Thanks, Miss Pally. And this is your invincible insight for the week. And uh, the most insightful thing I could say to you right now, it's election day, and I hope you voted. Janet and I did, and we're very proud of it, as did my children. So uh, let's make sure that you take care of your responsibilities and get that done. And other responsibilities you have, and I'm going to be speaking mostly to the leaders right now, and it's going to be uh, very simple. It's about this thing called confidence versus trust. You know, the trust that you have in your employees, your teammates, those around you, and you want to develop that trust. Well, how does that differ from confidence? Well, I'm going to give you a little football metaphor because I was just at a really cool football game up in Jacksonville uh, watching the Jaguars play the Raiders, and uh, right toward the end of the game when a really crucial kick needed to be made from the field goal kicker that was their 13th field goal kicker since 2020 for the Jaguars, and he, he had a doink. Boom. And the, you know, and the ball just hit the upright. And so anyway, Coach Peterson now, in a very critical part of the game, and they've come back from 17-0. They're the Jaguars. They come back from 17-0. And now they've got the lead, and they're leading by four with uh, just a, about a minute to go, and neither time has any timeouts. And instead of going for the, fir for the first down or for the touchdown, he decides to go with a 40, 45-yard field goal from this kicker that joined before, and guess what? He made it, and they went on winning the game, and it was really an emotional win, and after the game was over, I got a chance to talk to Coach Peterson, and I said, man, it's just really cool to finally see the trust that you've had in them be rewarded with them making the play, and he said, Vince, it's, it wasn't trust, it was confidence, and what's the difference between the two, and it's very simple. Uh, confidence is the assurance that you have in someone that they're going to get the job done, and the trust is the belief in someone that eventually they'll be able to get it done. So it's assurance versus trust. Uh, it's a pretty fine line right there. But he said, you know what? He says he wasn't going to miss two in a row, and I had all the confidence in the world. He'd get it made. Confidence versus trust. That's how you develop, that's how you develop an invincible team. And speaking of such, don't forget the Papali Group when you have all of your real estate needs. They're the ones that are going to help you make your dream come true. Have a great week, everybody, and I'll talk to you next week.